Assalamualaikum everyone Welcome back to my channel For today's lesson I am focusing on the reading skills And we are moving on to the new unit Or new topic Unit 2 under food, food, food Before we start our lesson I would like to ask you What is your favourite food? Or maybe What cuisine do you prefer to eat? Okay, I believe all of your selections or food are all delicious and also scrumptious. If you were to ask me what is my favorite food, I would like to answer I prefer Korean cuisine where I prefer Korean foods because they have the mix of spiciness and also sweetness in their food. Okay, shall we start our lesson right now? Okay, let's start with our goals for today's lesson. So our goals for today's lesson are you will be able to read and understand the text that we are going to read today. Okay, and then you will be able to match uh, three definitions to the correct selection of words. There are a total of five words. So at least you need to match three correct definitions. And lastly, you will be able to write the five correct answers in the blanks. Okay, so that will be the goals for our lesson today. Next, I would like you to turn to page 18 where we are going to read the text together. Once we have completed reading the text, we are going to discuss the information that is included in the text. An Oil for Life Maria Alcala of Madrid speaks for many Mediterranean people when she says that a meal without olive oil is boring. Nose, when the Mediterraneans first fell in love with olives, because it was before people wrote and kept records. However, there is some evidence that people began growing olive trees around the Mediterranean Sea approximately 6,000 years ago. The Mediterranean countries still 99% of the world's olive oil, with Spain being the world's biggest producer. From ancient times, today, the basic process of producing the oil is the same. First, farmers crush the olives. Then, they take the liquid and separate the oil from the water. Many olive growers keep their ancient traditions and still harvest the olives hand. We harvest in the traditional way, says Don Celso, an olive farmer from Tuscany, Italy. It is less expensive to do it with machines, but it's more a social thing. Twenty people come to help with the harvest and we pay them in oil. Ancient civilizations used olive oil money and medicine. They even used it during the war. They would heat it up and drop it down on the enemy. Days. It is still used in religious ceremonies, as it was in ancient times. It is also great for making fish and cheese stay fresh. There are even olive oil lamps and olive oil soaps. One important study showed that Mediterranean people have the hearts in the Western world. This is partly to do with frequently using olive oil. Other studies have shown that using olive oil can help to protect people from some types of diseases. The world is beginning to understand the advantages of using olive oil, and it isn't an unusual thing to see on dinner tables outside the Mediterranean region anymore. The olive oil producing countries now sell large of olive oil to countries in Europe, Asia, Africa and North and South America. Olive oil improves the lives of people everywhere when it is part of a well-balanced Ancient people knew about its benefits and modern science has confirmed them. Luckily, the Mediterranean people are happy to their secret with the world. How was the text? 
Yes, I think the text is very interesting. Okay, so let's just discuss on the text where I believe the text shares uh, about the information on olive. Okay, do you know what is olive? Can you guess um, which country does um, that we can relate with the usage of olive? Yes, usually we can relate olive Maybe olive oil when we can find it on pizza and also it was included in the process of um, preparation to make the pizza. So let's see the circle map that I have prepared. So we have here the title of the text itself. It is entitled as an oil for life. So may I ask you or may we discuss on what it is all about? Mm. Okay, the text actually shares about the olive oil where it includes the history of the olive oil, the history, the benefits and also the process and how um, from the scratch or from the original form of the olive itself and also it has been processed into the olive oil. Okay, that will be the discussion on the text there are total of six paragraphs all of those six paragraphs shares a lot of inform a lot of meaningful information for us as we get to know on the history of the text history of the olive oil and also some of the benefits and process we all know uh, olive oil actually give a lot healthier choices compared to using the normal or uh, palm oil. Okay, this is because uh, the nutrition that the olive could help hold is already uh, enough for us to enjoy our healthy lifestyle. Okay, that is all about olive oil. So let's uh, look to these words. Okay, we have five words that we are going to discuss today so we have the words evidence process liquid civilization and also disease okay have we ever made have we ever seen these five um, words i believe it's a yes when you go through some readings just now these words are some of the words included in the text isn't it Yes, these are the words that were included in the text. Where well, now, um, maybe some of the words you are familiar with it, such as um, liquid or process, where you um, meet most of it maybe in your science classes. However, now we are going to look for the meaning, okay, for the definition of these words, where I want you to scheme, okay, you need to scheme where you look into the text roughly where you skim and find these words and then you just read the sentences based on the sentences if you are able to understand okay and then you just relate to the definitions of the word okay let me show on how you are going to do this activity okay here are the template for the google jamboard that i will give you later so we have the five words we have evidence process liquid civilization and also disease when you find or when you skim the text i hope that you can find these words okay you just read the sentences included in the text and then you just match by making any mark or any line you can draw the line in the jamboard later i will show you on how you are going to do it okay this as an example the word evidence okay let's look into the text where you can find the evidence okay the evidence is in the first paragraph where it is stated however there is some evidence that people begin growing olive trees around the mediterranean sea approximately six thousand years ago so evidence is the word in the sentence where it show where it show um where it is included in the word and it shows the definition of okay how you are going to look for the definition again you need 
you just need to read the sentence and understand the sentence on what it is all about. So we have something like water that can that you can pour easily, a series of things that you do to make something, reasons for believing that something is or isn't true, an illness, something that makes you very sick, a large group of people with its own culture. So I believe evidence matched with the definition of reason for believing that something is or isn't true. In other words, evidence also known as proof. Okay, that is how you are going to do your um, task later. So you just drag in the Jamboard, you just drag evidence to this part. To reason for believing that something is or isn't true. Okay, I hope that you can complete it and we will discuss the answer later. We are going to discuss on the answers for the class activity. So first word, we have evidence. Something like water that you can pour easily. A series of things that you do to make something. Reasons for believing that something is or isn't true. An illness. Something that makes you very sick. A large group of people with its own culture. So evidence will go with reasons for something that... Reasons for believing that something is or isn't true. Which is it's... It is the same as proof. Okay, let's move on to process. Process is a series of things that you do to make something. Okay? A series of things that you do to make something. And for liquid, I think the most um, common liquid that we can say is water, right? So liquid is something like water. Okay, the word water. That you can pour easily. And then civilization is a large group of people with its own culture. And disease is an illness, something that makes you very sick. Oops, sorry. So this will be the answer for the matching parts in our class activity. Okay, welcome back to the last part. Okay, this is the next part after the class activity where we just match the definitions to the words. For this class exercise, you are going to fill in the blanks. Okay, however, there are some answer selection for you to select and once you have selected the answer, you just simply write it. I will link the Google slide link in the description. Okay. This is because you can enter the link and then you will see some blanks for you to just enter the answers using the text box. Okay. Let me show how you are going to answer your class exercise. Okay, you just click um, in the link. Click into the link. And then you can see we have Maria Alcala of Madrid speaks for many Mediterranean people when she says that a meal without olive is boring okay and then you can see we have blanks here how you are going to write the answers we have some answer selection right you just click on the text box okay you draw a box here and you can simply write the answer so the first answer for the blank is no one okay so that's it you just adjust the box and then you can continue answering all the rest of the questions. Number 2, number 3, number 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and also 10. Okay? That is how you are going to complete it. Once you have complete, we are going to discuss the answers together. Okay, let us now discuss um, the answers for the blanks just now. Okay, let us see the first questions. So, Maria Alcala of Madrid speaks for many Mediterranean people when she says that a meal without olive oil is boring. Blank knows when the Mediterraneans first fell in love with olives because it was before people wrote and kept records. However, there is some evidence that people began growing olive trees around 
the Mediterranean Sea approximately 6,000 years ago. So the blank here shows it is in the beginning of the sentence and then it starts with nose. Okay, so the answer would be C. No one knows when the Mediterraneans first fell in love with olive. Okay, the answer would be C. No one. Okay, you just type no one here in the Google slide by clicking on the text box. The answer would be no one knows when the Mediterraneans first fell in love with olive because it was before people wrote and kept records. We move on to the next question. Okay, the Mediterranean countries still blank. 99% of the world's olive oil with Spain being the world's biggest producer. Okay, it is blank here. The answer will be D. The Mediterranean countries still produce. 99% of the world's olive oil with Spain being the world's biggest produce. As the previous um, paragraph mentioned about the Mediterranean countries is the evidence of where we can see the olive trees. Therefore, Mediterranean countries still produce. Okay, They produce 99% of the world's olive oil with Spain being the biggest world's biggest producer so among the mediterranean countries spain is the country that produced the biggest that is titled as the world's biggest producer of the olive oil next the third one from ancient times blank today the basic process of producing the oil is the same First, farmers crush the olives, then they take the liquid and separate the oil from the water. So the word from here indicate there are sometimes time or period uh, from the past time until now. So the answer would be D, which is until. From ancient times until today, so from, from back then until today, the basic process is still the same. So we know that the process of producing the olive oil or the farmers will cut, crush the olive and then they take the liquid and separate the oil from the water. Hmm, that is very interesting. Question number four. Many olive growers keep their ancient traditions and still harvest the olives. Bang, hand. We harvest in the traditional way, says Don Celso. An oily an olive farmer from Tuscany, Italy. See, uh, just now we have discussed on the relation of olive oil or olive that it is uh, related to the Italy, Italian. Okay, it is less expensive to do it with machines, but it's more a social thing. The answer for number four would be buy. Okay. Many olive growers keep the ancient traditions and still harvest the olives by hand okay we cannot use on we cannot use in we cannot use with the correct word is by hand for question number five sentence number five ancient civilizations okay we have discussed on what a civilization civil, civilizations mean use olive oil blank money and medicine they even use it during war they would heat it up and drop it down on the enemy. So the usage of olive oil here, we can see they even use it in the war. Hmm. So right now, I believe we don't use it for war, but we mostly we can find the olive oil in cookings, right? So the word, the answer for the blank would be ancient civilizations use olive oil as money and medicine. Okay, the answer is S. Number six, blank. This it is still used in religious ceremonies as it was in ancient time. It is also great for fish and cheese stay fresh. So we can see just now I mentioned we use the olive oil for cooking, but we know that we use it these days. Some of them still use it as the religious ceremonies as the same as in the ancient time. Okay. 
so the answer for number six is these okay these days okay current days the answer is b these we move on to number seven one important study showed that mediterranean mediterranean people have the blank hearts in the western world this is partly to do with frequently using olive oil other studies have shown that using olive oil can help to protect people from some types of disease so you know that the mediterranean people is known as lightest heart lowest heart smallest heart healthiest heart okay the answer would be healthiest heart this now we have discussed on the benefits of olive oil where it can it is among the healthiest oil uh, for us to use um, in order for us to enjoy a happy lifestyle so the answer would be mediterranean people have the healthiest heart in the western world we can relate it as they are the biggest producer of the olive oil right so i believe the usage is larger and also frequent compared to us um, where we are not even the producer we are the consumer for the olive oil Question number 8, okay, we have question number 8 here. The olive oil producing countries now sell large blank of olive oil to countries in Europe, Asia, Africa, and North and South America. The word sell here, sell large, group, lots, or number. Okay, the most correct or most precise answer would be amount. Okay, so large amount of olive oil to countries in Europe. So Asia, Malaysia is part of Asia. I believe we are one of the consumer of the olive oil. I believe all of your household also owns at least or maybe use at least once olive oil in your um, cooking or in your food, right? For number for number nine, okay, olive oil improves the lives of people everywhere. When it is part of a well-balanced food, dish, diet, or plate, the answer would be diet. Okay. I think the biggest hint in this sentence would be well-balanced diet. Okay. Um, let's move on to the next question. The last question. Ancient people knew about its benefits and modern science has confirmed them. Luckily, the Mediterranean, Mediterranean people are happy to a gift, offer, share, or show their secret with the world are they offering something or they giving or they show or they share okay the answer would be C the Mediterranean Mediterranean people are happy to share their secret with the world where well, we know now now we know the consumption or the rate of consumption of the olive oil is increasing I believe all of us know the benefits all of us know the um, good side of consuming olive oil where it brings a healthier heart and also healthier lifestyle for us who consume it so the answer for number 10 would be share okay everyone we have almost reached uh, the end of our lesson just now we have read an amazing text about the olive oil the process the history and also the mediterranean people who shared their wonderful thoughts and also ideas on consuming the olive oil so before we end our lesson i would like to ask you what have you learned today yes we have learned something interesting about food okay the food that we focusing today will be the olive so the olive um, has been crushed and processed where we get the olive oil now we know that Olive oil um, is known or is very famous in the Mediterranean as they are the world biggest um, producer of the olive oil itself. I hope that you get something from today from today's lesson where we learn on uh, some words, some definitions, and also we write some answers where we match the meaning and also we read, understand and we finally managed to answer all of the questions. Thank you very much 
uh, everyone for joining my session and also listen attentively to my lesson i hope to see you soon thank you very much for participating and also thank you very much for your time i hope to see you soon on our next lesson next week thank you very much everyone bye